vice chair of the NBRPA. Right, right, right. And um, just really excited to be here for the All-Star Games so I can see all my buddies and friends. And we also take care of quite a bit of business while we're here as a board. Uh, right. The, the, NBA, the NBRPA is the organization that helps players transition from basketball to normal life. Right, right. Uh, and, and with that, we have a partnership with the NBA and the NBPA. Right. Um, our mission is to help players transition, number one. Number two is community projects and service uh, focusing on children and kids a lot. We have a life skills group called uh, Full Court Press. We okay. go around the country and we perform, uh, we have basketball clinics. And as part of those clinics, we do a life skills portion where we talk about financial literacy and, and, and uh, those kinds of things, sure. academics. You know, I, I, I'm, we're going to have uh, Arnie uh, Philco up here at 12 o'clock. Um, what's it like working with Arnie? It's good working with Arnie. Arnie's a hardworking guy. Matter yeah. of fact, the, our, our association has seen a tremendous uptick in its in ability to raise revenue and ability to raise revenue. Uh, in, in player programming, uh, well, as a matter of fact, you probably know that this just this year we were awarded a lifetime health care for any player who's played three years or more in the NBA. Wow, wow. for life! Wow. For life! That's the first time that's ever happened in professional sports. He health, lifetime health care. Lifetime health care if you played three years or more. I, I wonder if it's too late for me to try out. <laughs> I mean, really? I mean, lifetime. I, 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 that's a, I have another year or so. Uh, so, t t tell us, tell us about your 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 playing career. My playing career. I was the third player selected in 1972 by the Cleveland Cavaliers. Uh, played there three years. I was all uh, all rookie team, run up a rookie of the year. Uh, then I was traded to the Golden State Warriors, where I played with the famous Rick Barry and Gus Williams and a lot of really good players. I went the best record in the league that year and um, came up a little short to a team called yeah. Phoenix and, and which ultimately lost to Boston Celtics and Dave Oh, Jones. really? Yeah. Yeah. So, um, who would you say was the most fierce of all in terms of competitors? You know, that's an excellent question. At that level, these guys are so so competitive. You know, I, you know when you play against Julius Survey, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, Elvin Hayes, uh, uh, Walt Frazier. I even called Wilt Chamberlain for a year. Uh, it, Jerry really? West. Yeah. Austin. Yeah. <laughs> so, but I miss that. <laughs> and and so so, uh, um, what would you say was your best game? You know, uh, I had. I had quite a few. I had quite a few, so I can't remember. I can't but there had to be one. one that just really stood. Mm, not really. really stands out. I, I, I had a pretty good career. Well, I know that. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I know, but I, but I can't. I can't. Well, watch you have a seat right here with us. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, 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 not no, not one stands out. I'm, I'm not. Big, I'm not a big stats guy. Remembering what I used to do, I'm a kind of a forward, forward, a forward-looking guy. Right now, I do a lot of work in New Hampshire where I live with with youth. I'm on the Workforce Youth Council and what we do on the Workforce Youth Council we uh, we get money from the federal government and we have youth with challenges with employment opportunities and training opportunities so that they can have a good paying job. Yeah and, and that's that's the kind of work that the NBA or the NB uh, Retired Players Association is doing. I, I mean, so the things that y'all are doing here in New Orleans, uh, for an example, you know, because I guess the connection, the uh, uh, the games being here three years out of nine, and then of course Arnie being uh, uh, former uh, president of the uh, council, city council, and of course the Saints, and the stuff that y'all are doing, or I mean, it's hard. Warming, it really is. So yeah, go ahead. So no, so so we, we try to get in and do some really good work. And um, uh, as a member of the Players Association, I'm very lucky. You got a great man here, Mr. Chu Smith. He's doing a lot of work. This is the guy what, you should what? be talking to. Come join.